We going back to back, back to back? Let's get into it. What up, everybody? It's your boy, K-Ray06, back here on K-Ray TV, and we here for another reaction video. I just finished up Drake push-ups, <laughs> the official version, and my, I woke up and the streets was going crazy. They like, yo, Drizzy dropped another one. So I'm here. I said, I, I, I gotta leave in a few minutes. I am here to drop another one called Taylor Made. Oh, <laughs> the layers, the layers. You're Taylor Made. You're suited up and you're Taylor Made, Taylor Swift. All right, I we ain't, we ain't, we ain't gonna get too hype and we ain't even heard anything because it could be trash, but we'll see. All right, before we hop into this thing, shout out to the best squad on the net. Yes, that dream squad. Y'all make the world go round. I appreciate y'all every single day. If it's your first time here and you like what you see on this video or any other video in the collection, go ahead and hop over and hit that like button as it helps. Click that subscribe button, hit that naughty bell, and hit all and share like you care. And if you want to join our Patreon as well, <laughs> hop over to that. All right, but without further ado, I'm ready to get into this thing. Roll tape. Put these on so I can see better. Uh huh. Oh, this got a caption. Illuminati. It does rise again. You can see it in my eyes again. I know this man ain't using AI. No, sir. I know this man ain't using AI to sound like pop. Illuminati. Like a 12 gauge shotty. You feel me? I know he ain't. Oh my gosh, bruh. I'm from the West Coast, so bruh. <laughs> the layers! This man looking like Boogeyman. Does rise again. <laughs> you can see it in my eyes again. Oh, uh, I see it. And I got that. Let me stop. Come on. Kendrick, we need ya. The West Coast savior. Ain't great in your name and some hip hop history. If you deal with this viciously, you seem a little nervous about all the publicity. For this Canadian light skin doc, we need to know the baby West Coast victory, man. Call him a bitch for me. Talk about him liking young girls. That's a gift for me. Heard it on the button podcast. It's gotta be true. They told me the spirit of my belly is alive. And the nigga under five foot five, so it's gotta be you. I'm sorry, I'm trying not to, but sonically, this sounds amazing. The Gooseys is out. This sounds amazing. <laughs> you don't sound like Pac Token, but nobody can. But, bruh, just the layers and the thought behind this, like he going to <laughs> taking the spirit of Pac to be like, yo, bro, you got to do it for the West Coast. You letting the West Coast down. Like, <laughs> we didn't pass the torch to you, my guy. We need you to stand up. This is so sick. Let's go. Kendra, we need ya. The West Coast savior. Ain't great in your name and some hip hop history. If you deal with this viciously, you seem a little nervous about all the publicity. For this Canadian light skin doc, we need to know the baby West Coast victory, man. Call him a bitch for me. Talk about him liking young girls. That's a gift for me. <laughs> Heard it on the button podcast. It's gotta be true. They told me the spirit of my belly is alive. And the nigga under five foot five, so it's gotta be you. Uh -huh. I beat the whole fucking game. It was me and Snoop Dogg. Had my fucking shirt off in the house of blues. Okay, you gotta fuck this nigga, girl. He gotta get a views. <laughs> All that shit about burning tattoos. He is not amused. Wow. That's all for real thugs. You gotta be you. Right. You gotta leave this motherfucker fucking <clears throat> and bruise before we really lose. You ask for the smoke. Now I seen you too busy for the smoke. I won't lie. The people confused. Facts. Now you about to get this shit another week and fall back to home, girl. But running numbers up, I would have refused. Parties in the street relationships. She not in your shoes. Mm. You supposed to be the boogie man. Go do what you do. Unless this is a moment that you tell us this. It's not really you. In that case, there's nothing left to say. I just pass it to Snoop. Hold on, sir. Hold on, nephew. Hold on. Let's take. Let's just take a, a moment to acknowledge that verse. To acknowledge that verse, he basically using Pac to say like, "Yo, all them threats you was doing about taking chains and burning tattoos, like he ain't amused because they ain't you. You ain't no gangster. You ain't no thug. Like, uh, -uh stop that." <laughs> 
<laughs> Stop that. He was like, talk about talk about the girls. I heard the Joe Budden podcast, and I know what episode he's talking about. And you can tell that he, his ears to the street. And it's basically like a conversation. You can like, and you be in a room with your dudes and whatnot, and they like, yo, you gotta say something. They trying to gas you out, and they trying to throw stuff. I seen him last week with so and so, and he did this. Like, talk about that. Like, they trying to amp you up. And this is like Pop. This is that version with Pop saying like, yo, these a yeah, West Coast legend. He Pop. He's saying, yo, I'm, I'm giving you stuff here. Talk about this. Talk about this. You have to fire back because the streets are confused. The streets are confused. You are supposed to be the boogeyman. You supposed to be that guy, Kung Fu Kenny. You supposed to be all that. What you doing? And they keep moving the goalposts further and further. I just posted on uh, X the other day saying I just hopped on to see if y'all still moving the goalposts. Oh, it's still going? Right, I'll check back later. <laughs> because every day, it's something new. It's something new. Oh, now his silence is better than a track. Like, stop it. Stop it. <laughs> stop it. Drake is on his neck. This man, he is on his neck back to back. Now you use him. Let's go. Let's continue. Snow. Yes, yo. What the fuck you really got to do? You passed you the torch at the house of blues. Is that that? You got to do some dirty work. You know how to move. Mm -hmm. Right? Right? I know you've never been to jail or with jumpsuits and shower shoes. Never shot nobody, never stabbed nobody, never did nothing violent. And no one is the homies that empower you. But still, you gotta show this fucking eye of who's boss on the West. Now's the time to really make a power move. Cause right now it's looking like you're writing out the game plan on how to lose. How to bark up the wrong tree and then get your head popped in a crowd of rope. <laughs> World is watching this. <laughs> Y'all hear that? <laughs> this man is. Snoop is basically. <laughs> Dude, he's stripping him. He's stripping him of his armor, saying, like, you ain't a gangster. You ain't never been in, sh uh, in jail. You ain't never worn no shower shoes. You ain't did none of this gangster stuff. That's your, your men's that empower you. It's them that did it, that, that make you look tough. <laughs> it's them. Like, bro, you over here, you supposed to be the big boogeyman, so say something. Because right now, it's looking like you barking off the wrong tree. Like right now, it's looking like you showing them how to lose. You writing a gameplay on how to lose. Like how to get your head popped in a crowded room. Like you ain't even on a swivel. You just moving all messy out there. It's basically what he's saying. Like you making all the wrong moves. You showing everybody what not to do. Ah, oh, this man Drizzy. He never stabbed nobody, never did nothing violent, and no one is the homies that empower you. But still, you gotta show this fucking eye of who's boss on the West. Now's the time to really make a power move. Cause right now, it's looking like you're writing out the game plan on how to lose. Ooh. How to bark up the wrong tree and then get your head popped in a crowd of room. World is watching this chess game, but are you out of moves? Doubt you know the DOG never fucking doubted you. But right now, it seems like you posted up without a clue. What the Back. fuck you about to do? Yeah, um, that's the truth. Okay. I'm definitely about to come around the lane gang and let my fucking bow move. Shooting ah. on you niggas from a whole different altitude. Bruh. In the sky like I'm Howard Hughes. The first one really only took me an hour or two. Damn. The next one is really about to bring out the coward. Another one? Now we got to wait a fucking week because Taylor Swift is your new top. And if you about to drop, she got to approve. Wow. Girl, you act like you not in a few. She tailor made your schedule with Ant. You out of the loop. Hate all you corporate industry puppets. I'm not in the mood. I love it when you niggas talk loose like I'm not in the room Since like that your tone changed a little You not as enthused mm. How are you not in the booth? It feel like you kind of removed You trying to let this shit die down Nah, nah, nah Not this time nigga, you following through I'm sorry I'm sorry <laughs> I'm sorry, Trank <laughs> Trank is beating the hell out of Kendrick Beating the hell out of Kendrick Beating the hell out of Kendrick <laughs> He has beaten the hell out of Kendrick. He like, bro, Taylor Swift got you all <laughs> toe up over there. You want to act like the did since you dropped it, since the track dropped. You've been acting a little shifty. You've been acting a little shifty. <laughs> now you're going to try to wake this up? Nah, I'm on your neck. You're going to follow through. You want to, you, you say you're the boogeyman, that's step up. This man, I swear.
you niggas from a whole different the altitude. altitude. High up in the sky like I'm Howard Hughes. The first one really only took the me an hour, hour or two. The next one is really about to bring out the coward in you. But now we gotta wait a fucking week. Cause Taylor Swift is your new top. And if you about to drop, she gotta approve. This girl really about to make you act like you not in a few. She tailor made your schedule with Ant. You out, out of the, the loop. loop. Hate all you corporate industry puppets. I'm not in the mood. I love it when you niggas talk loose like I'm not in the room. Since like that, your tone changed a little. You not as enthused. How are you not in the booth? It feel like you kind of removed. You trying to let this shit die down. Nah, nah, nah. Not this time, nigga. You following through. I guess you need another week to figure out how to improve. <laughs> what the fuck is taking so long? We waiting on you. The rest of y'all are definitely involved. Y'all getting it too. Soon as you get the courage to drop, I'm out on the loose. On the loose. Yeah. Drizzy. Taylor Swift. Biggest gangster in the music game right now. Wow. You know, I moved my album when she dropped. I said that already. You know, she about to make you. I'm do a Millie Rock on your head top. She got the whole <laughs> piece playing on music like that Beyonce challenge. Y'all boys quiet for the weekend. Like, wow. I know you in that NY apartment. You struggling right now. I know it. In a notepad doing lyrical gymnastics, my boy. You better have a motherfucking quintuple entendre on that <laughs> shit. Some shit I don't even understand. Like, shit better be crazy. We waiting on you. Bro, we been yeah. waiting. Woo, woo, and woo. Bruh. That's the boogeyman. <laughs> That's the boogeyman. This man ain't duck no fade. He said, oh, okay, you want it? All right, I'm gonna make time for you. And he is making time. He is going out his way. This is, and it's crazy. And this track was fire. This is crazy. This is another bait track. He ain't even, he ain't going for the juggler. Yeah, he like, I want you to drop. Please drop. That is a chess move. This is what people don't know. When J. Cole dropped it, when he dropped his uh, last one, Push Up, these are chess moves. This is, I want you to reply with something heavy because a rebuttal is always better. A rebuttal is always better. Now I see your angle and I know how to attack your angle and add more to it. So they waiting for the, the boogeyman to come and drop a, a monster or people like, oh my God. And then they come back and be like, blah, and knock it over. Like, bro, is that all you got? And then probably drop a quick one on top of that to double up on them. And they be like, yo, these dudes are pumping out too fast. I can't keep up. <sighs> and this track was like that too. Now he added layers to it. Got the West Coast beat, got Pac and Snoop, and then him basically, Basically, like, I'm begging you to drop. We waiting on you. You say you the shooter. Come shoot. We in a gym right now. What you doing? Lace up. Lace up. You looking like you don't want to play now. You looking like you don't want to get on the court now. I've been here all day. What's up? What's up? Where you at? Where you at? You over there in the corner. Like, get up. Come on, Kung Fu. Get up. <laughs> this is crazy. Like, Oh man, 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 this is this is what we needed. This is what we needed. <laughs> this is what we needed. And he's still like, and I'm gonna get the mother ones too. I'm gonna get the mother ones too. I, I seen your track, Ross. I heard it. I heard it. I heard all the mother rumblings. I'm gonna get y'all too, but right now, this is the main event. I'm trying to get Kung Fu Kenny out. I'm trying to get the boogie man. Come on. Come outside. Oh, I'm loving it. I am loving it. I'm loving it because <clears throat> at the end of the day, Kendrick is not battle tested. And I keep telling people in these comments that he's not battle tested. So I, just like everybody else, I'm waiting for him to come out because I want to see him in battle mode. I want to see if he can handle battle mode. It's different between freestyling on the streets. Meek used to battle. And he got washed by Drake. So, Drake is, <coughs> excuse me, Drake is battle tested. He's been on beefs on wax. He know how to handle it, especially after the push of T one. I feel like he got stronger. Now he's like, all right, all right, I know what to do this time because that one was getting a little messy. So people have to like, hey, 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 hey let's stop this. <laughs> let's keep the peace. But this one, mm -hmm, back to back on it. So the last one only took an hour or two. Why you taking four, five weeks? Why you taking four years? Drop. Why you down there? Give me them 50 too. 
Let me know y'all comments below. <laughs> if I get some of them Kenny stands in the comments, bro, like chill out, chill out. Chill out, your boy ain't dry. Your boy ain't dry. I don't want to hear y'all pushing to go, oh, it's going to be all, 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 all. until he does something. We talking heavy. We holding the same energy. We holding the same energy. People over there talking about J. Cole. Oh, he apologized. See someone talking about, oh, he bent the knee and all this other stuff. He dropped something. <laughs> Faster than Kenny. <sighs> Anywho, <laughs> we back. Uh, we about to end this here. Like, comment, subscribe, and share. You want to join our Patreon, hop on if you care. We out. Peace.